welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today is the YouTubers Nail Art Weekly Stamping Collab and hosting this one is Francis from Dolphin Chick Nails and the theme is superheroes. Um, the Avengers movie I think it was opened this weekend. Really not up to speed on that kind of stuff but um, so the theme was superheroes and I was kind of torn between two designs so I asked my grandsons which one I should do and the um, choices were Batman and what did I do? Flash <laughs> and they chose Flash my daughter said it was close I've got three grandsons <laughs> so it was close the third one must have been on the fence about which one he wanted because it was two to one Anyway, so Flash one. Let's take a look at the awesome superhero manis that are coming up. Mine will be the last one, and I'll show you how I created it. Um, the links to the ladies' videos will be in the description box as soon as I get them. Um, but you're probably all following them anyways. Follow them, even if you're not following them already. Great channels to watch. Our um, Instagram links are also down in the description box, so visit us on Instagram. And I guess that's it. So let's take a look at the pictures and let's get started. I'll be using Wave Gel Shiny No Clean Top Gel and Base Gel. And right now I'm going to apply Dracula's Cup. Okay, so I'm going to apply Dracula's Cup to my um, index finger, my middle finger, and my ring finger. The base coat has already been applied. I just love this, this pretty sparkly color. This actually would also be good for an Iron Man, Iron Man color. It's really pretty. All right, so I'll just um, put this on the rest of my fingers, cure it, and come back. And I'm going to use Harvest Gold on my pinky finger and thumb. I didn't cure Dracula's cup yet. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I could have finished painting all my nails before I cure it. So Harvest Gold is a beautiful gold color. My grandkids voted for Flash <laughs> over, I think the other choice I gave them was Batman, <laughs> um, but this is good. And I'm going to put it on my thumb too. And this is a beautiful gold color. So now I'm going to cure all of this. Okay, now we're ready for our second coat. I'm going to go in with Harvest Gold first. Do that on my thumb. Okay, that looks pretty good. It looked a little sheer on the first coat. Not sure if I'm going to need three coats of that one or not. I don't know why it's looking so sheer. Then we'll go in for a second coat of Dracula's Cup. Okay, I'll do that to the rest of my fingers and we'll cure it and come back. 
Okay, so we got all the painting finished. Um, I top coated um, this finger, my thumb, and my pinky because I'm not going to do any stamping on this. And I removed the tacky layer from these two fingers. I had to top coat those, otherwise the tacky layer remains intact. I didn't want to get rid of it. Um, so, and I didn't want anything sticking to it. So that's why I removed that. So now we're going to do some stamping. The verse blade is my new Feeling Shapely from Lena, and I'll be using this image right here, this um, dot. And I'll be using my Moira um, White Stamping Polish, and that's Stamping Polish number 7. And I will be using my Queen Stamper because it's nice and sticky. And I'm just going to um, pop out the back here. Okay, so I'm going to pick up this big circle right here. And that's like the uh, circle in the center of Flash's uniform. And I'm just using my Bundle Monster Scraper because that's what I grabbed. Okay, so I think that circle will not work because it skipped a spot right there. So I'm going to try it again. This is a brand new plate, so I haven't ever used it. So let's check it out again. All right, put the polish on there. Okay, so I think that is a pretty good pickup. And I'm just going to go ahead, since I have gel polish on, I'm just going to go ahead and put that on there. It doesn't matter if some of the other stuff gets on there, because I'll just remove it with um, some acetone. And I didn't get it in the center, so I think I'm going to remove it all, and we'll try it again. Okay, so I got another pickup. I'm going to try looking at it this way. That in the center oh yeah that works out good okay so I'm just gonna clean up the mess and then we'll come back next we're gonna use this BM 305 round plate and I don't even believe that they're making round plates anymore but I know this one's discontinued um, we're just using the um, the lightning bolts and I'm using Dance Sledge in Gold, and the place where I get them from has been out forever, so I don't even know where you can get this one, but I really like the Dance Legend, um, I really like the Dance Legend, you know, po or polishes, stamping polishes, so you could probably just do a Google search on the internet. Okay. So let's scrape this, pick it up, and that's an awesome pickup. I'm going to take some tape and try to get some of this stuff out of the way. There we go. And this one is going to go right here. Well, that's too perfect. Oops. Spoke too soon. There we go. That looks pretty good. All right. So let's try this again. Okay. This is a really nice creamy stamping polish. And they're super opaque. So it's really nice polish to work with. Okay. So we'll just get rid of this out of the way again. I like this, um, I like this Queen Stamper because it's tacky, so I have a little bit of wait time, so that's pretty good. And this is going right here. That is perfect. So I'm going to clean this up. We'll add a top coat and we'll come back. 
So here is my Flash Manny, and I hope you guys like it. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.